हेलो आई एम डॉक्टर मयंक पाठक ऑर्थोपेडिक एंड जॉइंट रिप्लेसमेंट सर्जन मणिपाल हॉस्पिटल खराड़ी पुणे सो टुडे आई एम डिस्कसिंग आर्थराइटिस ऑफ नी इन यंग पेशेंट आर्थराइटिस एज यू ऑल नो इज इन्फ्लमेशन ऑफ जॉइंट इन्फ्लमेशन ऑफ जॉइंट विच इज हैपनिंग इधर ड्यू टू द अंडरलाइन कंडीशन लाइक रूमेटिजम और सोरियसिस और अदर आर्थराइटिस विच इज हैपनिंग ड्यू टू द एज Uh, which is degenerative arthritis also called osteoarthritis nowadays we are seeing patient who are coming up with arthritis in an early age normally we are seeing patient coming up with arthritis in late uh, 50s or 60s but now the min, uh, the median age of you know diagnosing arthritis diagnose arthritis is coming up less so the one factor is you know easy availability of the medical Uh, facility is also there so that people are coming up early in a hospital and doctor to you know uh, get their check and other factors are lifestyle changes sport injuries also uh, genetic predisposition some families also have uh, this thing ki they develop arthritis in an early age so arthritis in young adult is coming so just to explain what is arthritis there is a uh, just so this is a normal knee uh, where this is the upper bone which is called femur the lower bone tibia and they form the knee joint upper and lower bone there is a gap in between these and this gap is well maintained here in the arthritic knee the gap is not maintained and we can see the outgrowth of bone is also there so these knees where the gap is not maintained the bone is rubbing the bone and they are generating these uh, arthritic uh, osteophytes which is uh, causing the pain inflammation due to these all structures uh, are rubbing each other is the main cause of pain uh, in young patient arthritis are coming up due to sport injuries uh, which is neglected and uh, so if you have any sport injury you need to be properly checked with an orthopedician if it is acl injury meniscus injury you need to diagnose it early and then you have to go institute a treatment for this uh, even the osteoarthritis which is coming up earlier in uh, young young generation so this is mostly related with osteoporosis long sitting habits lack of activities Uh, so these are all can be correctable in an early stage and you need not to go for the directly for you know arthritic treatment for that lifestyle changes physiotherapy can be instituted uh, other factor which is uh, most commonly we are seeing right now is osteoporosis mainly post menopausal osteoporosis so in post menopausal osteoporosis the uh, overall health is going down in a female and they have more propensity to develop those uh, arthritic changes earlier so osteoporosis is a very uh, predominant uh, precursor of you know osteoarthritis and uh, other factors uh, which are coming up is you know uh, injuries uh, normally knee injuries and other which is treated and then uh, they are remain under treated or so they also you know leading to this arthritis so now we have a case uh, um, so she is a bank employee she has to climb up uh, stairs and she has developed arthritis in an early age so she came to us 10 year back and at that point of time just post menopausal she has uh, grade 2 arthritis and uh, we have started with the treatment options as i say in an early age we have you know treatment option so we started her on medication and physiotherapy regimes we instituted hyaluronic acid injections to her and she live her life 10 years a good sound healthy life and then afterward she chose to you know go for surgery uh we explained to her that still she can manage without surgery if she continue with the other modalities of treatment so that is now her choice to okay to now to go with surgery in her retirement age so uh we can uh salvage those needs there is not every time the operation is the treatment and that's why it is very necessary to come up to your doctor whenever you have trouble in an early stage 
treatment option for an early stage arthritis uh, medication. We have hyaluronic acid injection, which we institute in the joint. Uh, we have other options like uh, extra articular surgeries in form of uh, HTO and other options like uh, if a condition is only involving a single compartment of knee. So we can replace the only single compartment, which is called uh, very famously unicondylar knee replacement. All the facilities are available in uh, Manipal Hospital Karadi and uh, definitely total knee replacement is needed in later ages but uh, uh, we can prevent uh, going for surgery in early age. Life of implant is also a main concern. So normally we say around 20-25 years is a mean life of a knee uh, replacement. So uh, uh, timely institution of all these therapy is very important. So take home message for uh, of this discussion is that you need to diagnose your condition in an early and you know uh, stage. Whenever the knee pain is there, you should not neglect it. Uh, it might be a hidden sport injuries and something which lead to cartilage damage. So you need to uh, go to your orthopedician and let him judge ki whether you have some condition. Okay, thank you.